small. Look at this, this is my hand, ladies and gentlemen. Almost covers the whole thing. Ladies and gentlemen, it is pirate time and we are here at an auction. You're about to see a lot of my friends are here. Some people you know, some people you don't. There are two units here and there are two units the next and we need a unit. We're almost done sorting the train unit. If you haven't watched that amazing unit, you must go through and watch the playlist. Don't forget the like button, share button, subscribe. And actually, if you could, make sure your notifications are on. Double tap the bell. I've heard a lot of people say they're not getting notifications lately. That could be why. With anything... With that being said, let's get started and get to this auction. That unit looks intriguing. I see one, two, three bikes. Those are worth 50 bucks a piece easily. I see some things that should intrigue me. It looks kind of tossed. That unit looks really tossed in the top. If I didn't get a good clip, I'll show you in a second. But I opened it up for 200. I'm trying to bid high and hopefully scare everybody off. Seems fear works in this world these days. Uh, try to avoid. All right, guys, I got 200 bucks. Can we go 250? Three. Yeah. Fifty. Yeah. Four. Fifty. Five. Four fifty going once. Going twice. Four. Ooh. That's it, guys. Okay, this would be your unit. You'd have to roll it out. If you put like a big box for it in there and then like slide it in there, how do you get it out? What about the Push one? it all the way back. This is the one foot yeah. right. A hundred. hundred bucks. We're going 150? Yeah. Two? Yeah. 250? Yeah. Three? Yeah. 350? Yes. Four? Yes. <laughs> 450? Yeah. Four? Yeah. 50? 50? 50? 50? 50? 50? 50? 50? 50? 50? 50? All right, Pirates, we just bought the world's skinniest storage unit in existence. I'm very excited about this. We're about to take a quick peek real quick, see if there's any hidden treasures or what we have to come. Wow, I can't believe how small. Look, this is my hand, ladies and gentlemen. Almost covers the whole thing. What I liked about this storage unit was everything. You look right in there and you just see, it looks like somebody hoarded toys and collectibles and it looks like a possible firearm box, Jeebus says. And you come down here and you see comic book boxes. Let's pull some of this out and see. Exactly what I'm looking for to you. How about you tell everybody what you saw so far? Literally everything you want to see in a unit. Everything you don't want to see is not in there. Am not I looking at the camera? You're kind of looking at the camera if the camera was like at your feet. <laughs> what I decided is this unit's very skinny. I just pulled a bunch of stuff. I'm going to take all this home and go through it and make my video that way. How much is that video game for? How much what video game? Call of Duty Black Ops. What do you want to play it? Yeah, I'll, I'll buy it off you right now. I'll just give it to you because I like you so much. <laughs> I love you too. It's so sweet. All right, so we basically pillaged this unit. All the guys were standing around. They wanted to see it. And then I left all this for another day. It doesn't look too intriguing to me. And we got a whole back of the truck bed full of just great stuff. All I got to say is there's a pirate's chest right there. And we got, look at that, Hot Wheels. Whew, it's going to be fun. All right, pirates, we are here at my house. We are going to finish going through this unit real quick and show you all the cool stuff. We got this whole neat little pile from that world's skinniest storage unit. It was like a two foot by 14. I don't know what they really called it. But real quick, we'll go through all this. We got a pirate's chest. I'm excited to see what's in there. And we got just, well, I guess let's get to it. Is this little Rick and Morty blips and chits squirt squeeze spray play all day. Nice. It's a full set. I believe this piece, because I pulled this out, and if you were, my friends were there, Justin, Jeebus, baby Jeebus, Jeebus scanned this real quick, and he told me this sells for $200 on eBay. This little toy set here, Rick and Morty, mint condition, is a $200 sale on eBay. Maybe $189, I think he said also. But that's a good buy because I, I paid seven hundred dollars for this storage unit. 
This was in the front, covered in dust. Look at that. See that? See the fingerprints are on there because of me. There was no fingerprints. But somebody had, in my eyes, been in this storage unit since the last time or before. It wasn't original. They, they've taken something out and then walked away a couple for a long time because of the level of dust. That's, I guess that's the best, best way of putting it. We got a Badger. Model 150. That's nice. This might actually be a good... Then we have a hero, full metal nice. Nice little remote control car. I said a remote control car. So I have baby Jeebus messaging me, so I'm reading his messages while I am looking at this. Is there a remote control helicopter? That's kind of cool. And we have this right here. This is a Euro rack, because that's what it says. That's the only reason I know. I'm, I'm saying it like, I'm not saying it like, oh, this is a Euro rack, if you don't know. It's a Behringer Euro rack, UB124X Pro. I don't know really exactly what it is. Preamp, invisible. Is it open? Yes. Let's look and see if it's brand new. This makes a big difference. Um, I, I believe I've gotten similar things before. And this is like a lower end. Pro Ooh, yes. Look at that. That is brand spanking new, but it looks like something was there. That's the power cord. Hmm, I could be wrong. If you get the feel, something should be there. But that might be with just out without even looking it up. I'm gonna speculate a hundred bucks on eBay. It could be more, could be less. I just don't think it's a very expensive brand. This right here. More DJ equipment. This looks used. We need to find a power cord for this. Digitech. Let's go here. Let's do buttons. Yeah. Okay. I don't know why. I guess different colors. Interesting. Cool. Well, not to power cords. Ooh. That's kind of neat. Wicked, 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 wicked. Digital music mixer, Mixy Man. Interesting. Those are kind of cool. That was in there. And some type of foreign coin. Huh. I'd be so tight if these are for an F-150. Oh, I need some of these for my trunk. What? Ooh, look at this, son. Do you want a hat that says equality? Um, I think I'm selling. Huh? I said, I think I'm selling. Oh. By the way, son, I'm filming. Did you? If you didn't notice. Look at all these. Found. Found. Son, I can't see you. Dang it. Oh, that's an airsoft clip right there. Is that an airsoft shotgun? What is this? Is that a disc? Is that thing you spin around? <laughs> I think so. You go like, yeah, like in Olympics. The thing where you go like this? Yeah, that what? Olympics thing. Yeah. I don't know what that's called, but. Wow. So. Is it heavy? I don't know. That's the first one of these I've ever found in a, in a storage unit. Is it heavy? Um, here, hold it. That's not, that's not like terribly huh? heavy. Just, just go like. That's easy. Yeah. 
When? Eight B. Right here. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> She's like eight. I remember Bryce had one of oh, those. There's a whole bunch of gats in here. Ooh. Look at this one. This one looks familiar. Is this from Space Jam? Yeah, that's the alien gun. From Space Jam? It's just like the Looney Tunes alien, you know? Okay. Who doesn't like a good military duffel bag? Son, what do you know about military duffel bags? I have no idea. Oh. No. They're heavy. Son, you're, already, you're way off already. They I'm looking for plugs for these. Ooh, what's this? Is this for an Xbox? Your old Xbox. No, oh, it was on medicine. Ibuprofen. Amoxicillin. All right. He wasn't taking bad stuff. He went to the movies. Chipotle. Found gift cards, right? There's a, there's a, there's a gift card. iCraft. That's a gift card, I guess. Chipotle gift card. Okay. What else do we have here? Nada. Pop Rocks. Ooh, look at these goodies. Nothing. Okay. Nothing in there. Ten four. Nothing. Oh, <laughs> little crowbar. What is that? Pencil set. like a little electronic criminal thing or something. I don't freaking know what this is. Uh, basic toolkit. <laughs> For what? Is he a mobile cell phone repairman? Does that sound like a good title? Bought mobile cell phone repairman's version? There's actually nothing in this bag. What is this for? Well, it seems kind of cool for the uh, light kit. Ooh. We're going northwest. Speed stuff. Los Alamos. I want you to look into my eyes and tell me. Just kidding. Cute little pocket watch. Not very, actually it's probably only a couple dollar watch. It's the type of item that would go into a mystery box. I make them 25 to $1,000. So this would be like three to $5 considered in a box. I put nice items and low items. I put all over the map. This is pretty cool. A 9M8. A BM-800, some type of microphone. Comes with this little filter now. That's gotta be a few dollars. Sun. Did you say sun? No, I said sun. Oh, okay. Look at this, ladies and gentlemen, it is ammo. Whoo! What do we need ammo for? Cell phone, empty cell phone, Xbox One, empty controller. And I haven't seen it. That's a, where is that? It says Elite on. That's a nice fancy box. The box is probably worth five or ten bucks. Who knows? Come on, be something in here. No. There's a little headset like Michael wears. No, not my like Yeah, what? I said mine's probably better. Um, don't be stuck up about your your headset. It's just because you bought it from me. 
Remember, there's always going to be a better headset in the world, Michael. Oh, yeah, obviously. Look at this. Remember you guys that wanted to get this one time? <laughs> uh, some copper cream. What? You want a sticker of a lion? No, oh, this probably goes to this, so you could play with that now. You want a DS charger? Microphone. Finally found something. That, that sounds empty. I don't even want to open. I know it's empty. You can just fill with. No, not everybody's gonna buy pirate. There was a hundred dollar bill in there. So, for that reason and that reason only, we have to open it, yes. Why you say that, Michael? Because I found a hundred dollar bill once. What? Because I found a hundred dollar bill once. Where'd you find a hundred dollar bill at once? I, I want to say it was a wallet. Like a, a small little wallet. Or a small little bag. It was a fanny pack and a one dollar unit. Yeah. Look at that. Mario Kart with the DS. Dang, that's, that's like or something. There was a charger here a second ago. Here it is. Now it's complete. Are you over here mocking me, son? No. Hmm? See, that's the normal DS. Excuse me? That's the normal DS, so it's not worth anything. <laughs> you don't know that? What are you, a DS specialist? You got us those in 2009. Look at that collection of bullets. Whoa. Okay. That is unique right there. My there's change in here. Can you pick all this change out for me? And put it in my change jar? Please. Look, it's all right there. Cop piece of aluminum. Well, what do you got? It's over here in this tote. Right here. Yeah. That is weird. What does it even do? It's just a weight. What is this for? This could very well be for one of these. Ooh, stickers? What are these? Are these anything? I don't think so. Ooh! There's like a little. Look at that. The fridge is spinner. You got excited. Remember, remember the month these days were cool? These were cool for like a year, I think. Like seventh grade for me, so like four years ago. You really wish that exploded. Yeah, I was trying to throw one of those at you. <laughs> This is a weird st Ooh, look at these rocks. Ooh, you know who likes rocks? Don't say it out loud. <laughs> I don't know. Look at this, <laughs> a Rubik's Cube. <laughs> what is that? I don't know. What is this? This is kind of cool. You want a new cell phone? Yeah, I kind of do need a new one. That should oh, here you go. I got you a better one. Let's go. That's the new phone you're gonna get. When, you, when you're out of school and you want to tell everyone, hey, you want to text me? Look, I got a keyboard. <laughs> no? Wouldn't that be so cool? You got a keyboard on your phone. Oh, look, and I got a tablet. This is enough change. There's a lot of little things in this. this <laughs> Ooh, found gold coin. Real? I freaking wish, son. Ooh. That would be nice. Your coin what? That dollar? That chain. Yeah, that's a coin star video. I'm guessing that's like four hundred and eighty-five dollars right there. Mm. Actually, that's kind of a lot. It's probably like. What he's referring to is my jar of change I've been saving, and that, ladies and gentlemen, will be a coin star video soon. That's kind of cool. I thought it comes with a remote control. It's a VR set. Yeah, I don't know how it works. Put your phone in or something. Yeah, but it's for an Android. Does it work for an iPhone? I'm pretty sure. Samsung Gear VR with controller as 
it was 40 now, 27. So maybe that isn't as cool as I thought it was, but it wasn't even in the box. It was sitting like that and sitting like that. Then we got this thing here, a BT Oxen Micro Slot USB FM radio. This could be legit. This could be too legit to quit. Too legit, too legit to quit. Hey, hey, hey. What? It does USB. It has, I don't know. Thought this was gonna be cool. Where's the battery go? DC5 right there. Okay, so it does an Android. Oh, maybe that's how it plugs in. There's USB. Have to check that out. I wonder how it works. It's on the safety. Oh, if only I could shoot you with this, son. This comes with the box here. It's out of the box. We probably have no balls in there, so whatever. But it's probably a couple dollar. It has a velocity of something or other, and it does things, it says. I'm unsure because it has been a while since I played it in this gun. Look at this, Michael. Look at those flowers. Our soppy love story. Ooh, I love a good soppy love story. All right, I'm not sure about this. Needs to go back. Good to say. Ooh, look at this. Oh yes, Michael. Want to play Legos with me? What kind of Lego set you think this is right here, Michael? Mm -hmm. I see like a car, I think. You see when you use your hands. I think it is, uh, what, I don't know what it is. Fire truck, it's red. No, camper. Looks like a fire truck. That's a cool little set, though. That is money. Then we got. That's the magazine for it. <laughs> what is this up? Tell me what this is. Use your phone real quick and scan that, or my phone. Tell me this sells for you. Know. Comic books. Gera Generation X, all new number one. And it looks like we have a bunch of comics in an exhaust pipe. Screws. And then we got these, which I'm probably gonna auction on my auction. They'll be gone before this video comes Bro, out. Only like $10. Just that is what is the gun it goes to go to? What this big gun? That, yeah, what is that? What's the price on that? Batgirl. Superman. I can't be your Superman, your Superman. These are newer comics, but don't get me wrong. Comics still have value. I believe... I, I'm unsure, but it's usually more rare ones when it comes to newer ones that have more value. Phoenix Part 1, issue number 69. I like that one. All right. Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man. Shout out to Spider-Man. That's friendly... That's a number one. Some cool little... Look at that. Number one, Spider-Man, Spider-Man... These are all in mint condition, it looks like. Team the new Avengers, number one. This one says number ten. I'll probably put these on my auction for sure. Huh? I said it's Rick. Is that Rick? You yeah. see this thing? You see some crazy? This thing's like 189 to 200 bucks. I think it's the same guys, right? Oh yeah. Rick and Morty? Really? Yeah, yeah, those look nice. Huh? Everyone, everyone loves Rick and Morty. They do? Mm -hmm. a lot it's a cool little... Oh, look at this. You notice that this was two swords? One sword fight? <laughs> no? You can put that in one of the um, mystery boxes. Expensive what, the sword? Box. No, the Rick and Morty thing. Since you put those in there. You want these for school? <laughs> these socks? 
Oh, no. What the heck? No? These are just too long. Without even stretching them, they go to your knees. That's not, that's not cool? No. <laughs> I can't, I can't tell you what the rest of that says, but you guys could use your imagination. <laughs> it says, heck, Trump. Yeah, it says, heck, Trump, huh, son? Mm -hmm. <laughs> we can't show the customers. Don't get mad at me. I don't have a political view. I don't stay on either side of the fence. I'm neutral. I just find that funny. Oh, look and see there's a square in there. I always check for squares. Oh, what is this? Please be something in there. Look. Uh, this is a uh, graduated thing. Oh, yeah. I knew it. What does it say? No square feet. Hmm? No. Does it say anything on the inside? Hmm. It says something, but I can't read it. He paid for a down payment balance, 263. Does it say like silver or gold? What is this thing? Never mind. It's just like a baby. A hard drive? Yeah. It says DR. Hmm? It says the initial DR. DR? Yeah, and that's it. What is this? Ooh. -hoo. Look those up for me. Like a micro machine? Look at that. World's smallest Hot Wheel. Oh, imagine that. We got panties. No, that's not panties. I can't even put that on my mouth. I was so close to doing that. Ooh, look at another one. Look at another one. Look how small those are. Found world's smallest Hot Wheel. That's a cool rock. Okay, so that's a good rock there. Yeah, that's kind of cool. You can't find it? Mm. Mm. Can we show them again? Because I don't think we even showed, showed them really. Show all the pirates the cards right now up front. Oh, that's some cards. Bro, is that fossilized poop? <laughs> Tell me. Haha, <laughs> you, well, you really just took poop out of my hands. You're holding it first. I didn't. Can I jump off a bridge with you? Um, what I love yeah. about Michael by Dad. You're my son. That's a, that was a boring thing. Yeah. What'd you do with my thing just now? What, your poop? Yeah. Oh, sorry. No, it's just fine. Just keep the poop. I thought you were going to put it in your room next to your computer as a good luck poop. I'm fine. That's like a thing. I don't, you know think, that? I don't think it is. It is. It's like literally you take poop and you put it next to your computer and it's said to bring good luck like four leaf clovers. Oh, really? Dang, yeah. it's a drum. It's a nice looking drum. Jerome? Jerome. Jerome. I thought you were saying Jerome. Nah, yeah, I'm saying Jerome. I don't know if that's just a, a soft spot in there. It's by High Sonic. It doesn't look very fancy. Oh. Is it oh. All right, an Xbox One. That's not bad. Looks to be like virtually brand well, you new. Know. Special Ferrari wheel. The Thrustmaster. Ferrari F. 4 FD8, 58 Spider Racing Wheel. What the? What is this? What is this for? I don't like this. I 
Now I have to call somebody and ask them what the heck that it's illegal or not. And we got flares. Xbox 360 games. Mass Effect 3. Madden 10, which usually don't sell for much. Call of Duty Day Zero Edition. Assassin's Creed 3. It is in there. That's a good sign because most of the things have not been in this unit. Have not been in there. Ooh. This looks like a special edition, so that could be good money right there. Looks like we got a whole slew of games. Battlefield 3. Jet Cause 2. This is for 360, though. That's a little older. It's not for the one. Call of Duty Ghosts. The Walking Dead. Sniper 2. Wolfenstein, Forzna. What in the world is this? This looks dangerous. Ooh. Ooh, shoot. That was not cool. It's a toy. That's nuts. I'm gonna leave that out in case one of the children come out here and touch that and it gets them. Um, skateboard wheels. Empty knife case. Another game, Skirim. That's in there. Mm, world's best wallet kit. What? Do you build your own wallet? No games, Battlefield 4, Dishonored, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Destiny, That goes with that one special edition. Nothing. Okay. Hand flash. Ho ho ho. So this is all these little items here will end up at the flea market. No food. It's like an eBay item. This is the, the, the randomness in this storage is absurd. There's so many stuff, different things it's like all over the map. Ooh, that is kind of cool. That'll end up on the auction, I think, or in a mystery box. Please be in here. I wouldn't mind some Beats by Dre's when I'm laying in bed.
You always got to get to the bottom of a box. Because you never know what's going to be down there. There's no... Okay. Geneva. These are kind of cool. I'll actually legit will probably end up wearing these. You'll see those in a video. The watches will end up... More box of comics. Cumex. Cumex books. Mouse Guard. The Ghost. It's a book. Actually, these are kind of cool. These are kids' books, right? Mouse Guard, Shadows Within. No. These are like weird little comics. I thought they were like little kids' books. I was going to keep those for a minute. Then we have X-Men. An X-Men. Then you carefully see some Wolverine. Just go on Wolverine, Wolverine. They don't look like the older ones, but they still... I'm unsure of their value. I don't want to say, hey, there's so much there. They cost $2.25 whenever they purchase them. $3.50. A lot of Wolverine. This one's number 50. That one says $7.25 on it. That one could be a good one. That's interesting that it has that. So it's Wolverine, Wolverine. A bunch of Wolverine. Wolverine, X-Men, X-Men, X-Men. Good brands. All right. Not a bad little box. Probably put this, this will actually end up on my auction as well. This beautiful... What do you call it? A steampunk? Is that, 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 that I don't know what my is steampunk. But this steampunk pirate chest. Did I say pirate chest? We have a steampunk pirate chest. We're gonna open right now. Nice. I knew something was in here. Just kidding. I kind of peeped. <laughs> Let's see, Let's see if we can pull this aside a little bit. That looks like... Not silver, not gold. Just metal. Could be like little play things. This, be, this was a younger guy. Younger guys don't usually have gold and silver. This is like half a heart. That's sad. I love you. And somewhere else, somebody really used to love him. So they had this one, too. This one says, Shay. C-H. Kind of cool. It's like the Lord of the Rings. Got a nice lion's head. That's cool. Danny. The black ring. All right. Another love thing. Nothing special. This was almost cool, but I don't think it even has any. It just says, I love you. And there's no other half. Then we have $2 bills. How you get them in there and how you get them out. That's a good question. I guess you gotta break them. And then, look at this. There is Pokemon cards. Ooh, and we have stickers. Look at these stickers. Brains. Okay. These will definitely end up on the auction.
not seeing anything that says first editions on them, but they're in good shape. Okay. All right. Energies. Talk of monsters, energies. That's a lot of energies. Okay, so that's basically all the Pokemon we got there. I don't know why Diglett's in there, and what's the other one? There seems to be a couple cards in this. Diglett, Pontoya, Magitrick. Those must have been the cards for him. All right. It's not bad, all this stuff. What I say? I had $700 on this unit. I think... It's safe to say I'll make some money on the unit. Not like some, you know, retirement style money, but that's a good little paycheck. That's what it's about. I think a $700 was a good investment on this. Over a little bit of time, a couple eBay ads, a couple flea market sales, a little bit of junk pile because that was a small unit. I will turn that $700 into at least $1,000. I have to get $1,000 out of what you see there. Oh, and this sword. Do we miss this sword right here? We did. And, yeah, like like I said, this is almost 200 Yeah, I think it's safe to say it'll make some money. Unsure if I'll show the rest of that unit in this video or if it'll come somewhere in the, another video if there's something interesting in there. It's just a tiny bit left to go. Thank you all for watching. I love you.